on my MacBook Air 7.2 Dell Inspiron 7352 i7 and I'm running 10.12.3 and what is working audio is fully functional Bluetooth also have handoff supported camera so handoff supported means that I can air drop with my iPhone or any other Apple devices airdrop airdrop is here wow it sees Louis right away so what can I drop so let's drop this one wow you see very nice battery sound with HDMI this one is DW1560 I replaced with the original one that has both 5 gig and 2.4 gig Wi-Fi card reader this is my card reader right here okay Ethernet, this one doesn't have Ethernet card DW 1560 in here and it's detect as EN0 already so you don't need to know Ethernet from rehabbing anymore so I message and everything will work the graphic display is fully functional with the uh, all the QECI acceleration and this one the device ID is 1616 but I have to eject 1626 0006 for it to get fully functional printer we use the wireless air print brother and it's already there J485 DW and USB all of them are there Wi-Fi so the Wi-Fi uh, DW 1560 is a must to, to buy because it supported both 2.4 gig and 5 gig and also the Bluetooth 4.0 is actually working with the airdrop it's really good keyboards controlling the sound F2 F3 The backlight, F11, turn off, F12, go higher. Wow, 94. Now this is on the left side and the one in the front. So let's try the one behind it. Same. It's pretty good. So let's try the USB 2.0 on the right hand side. Mm. So I think they're all USB 3.0. Yep, USB 2.0 hub, Total Mobile. So they do see this USB 2.0. So right now it's just running. So let's stop it. So it dropped. Good. 
Alright, it's working. This we create some music. That's it. Weather. Here is the weather today. Wow, Fremont is 51 degrees. It's raining, supposedly. McDonald's. Okay, work. Here's what I found. Very nice. Thank you. Sandlymac.com Wow. So after reboot, we can see it right here. Wow. 2.4 gig and 5 gig. Both. That's good. So I move, it works perfectly. We have to do with the newest one. Version 10.1.4, that's the newest one. Now, we also have Fuse installed. So we're going to drop files in Windows. Isn't that nice? So look for the video that I show how to uh, do that. We got problem with the audio speakers not turned on after wake up. All of them is caused by Kodak Commander. It's called the uh, EAPD. If you look and make sure you put the HDA verb in the user bin. See? You, you put it in the user bin. And if you look at you got to add it, the Kodak Commander, the latest one. And you go to the info list. And you go to IO Kit Personality, uh, Kodak Commander. And then you go to the profile. And then you look at the default. So the original one, let's. So look at this. Perform reset on EP. EAPD fail the original one said no you have to turn this one on if it fail then do yes and also look at your codecs okay so if ALC Realtek mine is 255 and they use the profile um, ALC 283 ETC and I look at it ALC 83 you look at this perform reset is no you need to change this one to yes you need to reset everything 